rate. Right. You got to know why you charge what you charge. Mm -hmm. Okay? Because an honest hourly rate is not just something you pulled out of your arse or you're copying the, what you think the market will bear or mm -hmm. handle, what your customers are telling you the will and the pay. Right. Or you know what you know what what your competition is charging supposedly, and mm -hmm. you're going to charge a little less. You know that's that's not honest. That's yeah. dishonest. Okay. In fact, you're stealing from the customer, mm -hmm. and you're stealing from yourself. Okay. Yo, even worse. But to truly know what we call your honest hourly rate, mm -hmm. because your honest hourly rate, okay, is figured by knowing what you're selling, mm -hmm. which we also will learn is you're selling time, selling not plumbing. Time. Okay. A little freebie mm -hmm. there. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. You're selling time mm -hmm. and you're putting all these expenses, all this kind of stuff built into your honest hourly rate. Mm -hmm. So all these things, this doesn't matter. This is just a little game you play. Just like, well, okay, yeah, it's 24% of this. Blah, 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 okay. No. All right. All this stuff mm -hmm. is built in here into your honest hourly rate. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. So it's where I'm assuming that you're figuring up your honest hourly rate. Okay. Okay. All right. Got it. I'm also assuming, assuming yes. okay, mm -hmm. that you're paying your guys um, the fairest way as well. Okay. Um, and you're paying peace rate. Mm. Okay. Charlie says, at least set up the freedom to choose to work in the business if you want to, not because you have to. Yes. That's true. Okay. Yep. And that's what this allows you, mm -hmm. allows you to do. Okay. Hi, um, Charlie, by the way. Well, I want to get to that. I want to yes. introduce what this is. Okay. okay. Hey, Charlie. Hey, yeah. Charlie. And it's assuming that you're paying your guys piece rate, mm -hmm. which again is based on time, on your time, okay, right. <laughs> not their time. Again, <laughs> when you're paying when you're paying a guy hourly, you can't control. That's you know you can't you can't control that. Right. A guy's just going to sleep out in the hammock. He'll take two uh -huh. hours, four hours, eight hours, do this job a for week. whatever reason. It doesn't okay? matter. All right, right. right. You can't. That you're you're on. You're at his whim. His mercy. And his mercy. Yeah. Right. Lance is saying he loves right. piece rate. Piece rate, example of piece rate mm -hmm. is now now you can figure, you know, a task up that I'll pay three hours for this water heater install for a standard water heater installation. We'll just mm -hmm. use that as an example. Sure. Okay. Okay. And so you're that's all built in here. Mm -hmm. There's your labor. I'm not right. paying any more than three hours mm -hmm. <laughs> okay on that task. So you know and you're paying that. Okay, so now you know what the labor is. You don't have to go find out what they turn in. You know, what, what, what they turn in at the end of the week? What am I you paying? Know. I don't know. He's, he's you know what it hours. is. Whether okay. it took him an hour or whether it took him four hours. Right. You know. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's also the guys love it. They really do love it. If you ask guys if they want to change what they're doing, no, no guys don't like change. But yeah. guys love piece rate. Right. Because uh, that's truly how a guy can do six figures and better in, in residential service plumbing without mm -hmm. having to work 80 hours a week. Right. Guy can get paid 80 hours and only work 40. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's All right. Beautiful. Okay. So it, it's a beautiful thing. Mm -hmm. Saw it time and time again. Mm -hmm. The guys that don't want to work piece rate, you don't want those guys anyways. You don't want them. All right. They're, yep. they're screwing you. Right. 